gentleman behind the counter, I said, excuse me, sir, I need a long piece of rope. He said, I don't blame you, I've seen your act. I said, hey, buddy, you can't talk to a customer like that. He said, you haven't bought anything yet. So I quickly purchased my piece of rope so I could show you a classic of magic. I'm going to ask this nice lady, would, would you help me out? Let's give her a big round of applause as she makes her way up here on the stage. Would fly over here to my left would be great. And is it uh, it's Libby? My name's Kevin. Let's give Libby another big hand for helping me out. <laughs> Libby, here's what I need you to do. I want you to check out this rope. Check it for any mirrors, false compartments, or trap doors. No, seriously, Libby. Check it for any Velcro magnets, tape snaps. I'm going to use any of those things in this trip. I save all that up for later. Okay? Now, Libby, stay up here. I need you to follow my instructions. I want you to help me out, and if you do just as I ask you to, at the end, I'll let you do the magic, okay? Don't look so excited about that, all right? Okay, well, you're going to be great. Here's what we have to do. We have to cut this piece of rope into two equal pieces. They must be the same size. The best way I know how to do that is to bring the two ends up here, making them even. Use my finger and thumb, drag it along the rope. Whenever we end up uh, with a loop, once we stretch out the rope, that's where we need to cut it. The rope. Okay, go ahead. Grab the scissors. Now, Libby, we're going to have you cut the loop. Now, oh, be careful. The white stuff, that's the rope. The pink, those are my fingers. Okay? Seriously, Libby, if you would go ahead and be careful yourself. Excellent. Now, as you can see, we have two pieces of rope that are equal. Okay, uh, Maybe it's, maybe it's me. Uh, we're a little bit off here at the, at the bottom. But I tell you what, Libby, um, I'm not supposed to be the magician, right? Check this out. We'll try something. We'll grab two hands. If we just give them a little rub, here, we'll just start over. Well, folks, you, yeah, oh. You guys, let's say, usually I get a little hand for that. Uh, that's okay, Libby, uh, because uh, I, I've got one right here. It's a little hand for those of you. Folks, the jokes aren't going to get any better, all right? Trust me, my school laugh. What I do is called comedy magic, Libby. If it's not funny, it's just straight magic. Okay? Libby, let's try that again. If you would grab the scissors, and we'll put the ends even, and uh, you would go ahead and cut the loop. Be careful. Okay, excellent. Now, as you can see, we have two pieces of rope that are exactly the same size, especially this one. Okay, Libby, check this out. I'm going to tie the two ends in a knot. Now would be a good time for you to be thinking of some creative magic words. Do you know any magic words? Focus, focus. Focus, focus. That's worked for hundreds of years. It should work here at the Gay Lord today, right? All right, check this out. I snap my fingers, wave my hands. I'm going to show you how this works, and then you're going to do it here in a minute. Focus, focus. Chicken bones choke us. I just threw that in. All right, check it out. Let's see what happens. The knot slides right off, restoring the rope once again. Stay in your seats, folks. All right, excellent. You may have to grab the scissors with me. We're going to try this again. Right about there. Folks, I'm going to keep doing this until you like it. All right? <laughs> Let me do me a favor. Take, uh, take your rope. We're going to do things in reverse this time. We're going to tie the two ends in a knot first. Okay? Just to change things up a little bit. So go ahead. Yes, tie yours. I'm working her to death up there. Give her a big round of applause. She's doing a great job. Excellent. Okay, just tie it in a knot. So we tie the knot first, and now we're going to cut the rope opposite of the knot. So if you would grab the scissors for the last time, we're going to cut uh, my rope. So we have two pieces tied together in the middle. I'll take yours. We're going to cut it right about here, and we're done with the scissors. You can go ahead and set those down. Okay, now let me take your rope and pull on the ends, not on the knot. Just, okay, mine's coming a little bit loose. Make sure your knot's real tight by just pulling. All right. Now, Libby, you remember your creative magic words? Focus, focus. Let me show you one last time what everything should look like. Snap my fingers, wave my hands. If I say the magic words, Bula Bula! Big Stula! Check it out, it slides right off. I'm storing the rope one more time. Okay, say it up, folks. Ladies, uh, ladies up. Okay, all the pieces of rope up by one end. Make this a big show, nice and high. Snap your fingers over the knot. That does nothing, it just looks cool. See if it works.